Post processors add additional effects after the scene has been rendered. 3GS provides an effect composer, which pipes multiple post processors, also called passes, to get any kind of different post processing effects. Simply create a new effect composer, then add the so called render pass, which provides the input to the effect composer. The input is created by the 3GS renderer. Then in the animate or render loop, instead of calling the renderer, you call the effect composer. So far nothing has changed, but you can add more passes to the effect composer. There is a list of built-in post processors. Let's try the film pass. We create a new one, provide some parameters such as noise intensity and scanline intensity and add it to the effect composer. Then you see the result. There is also the shader pass for custom post-processing shaders. This pass requires a shader in the constructor. And of course there is a bunch of built-in shaders which we can use. Let's try the pixel shader and add it instead of the film pass to the effect composer. Now we have a pixeled result. You can pipe multiple passes and get complex effects. Let's check out the most basic post-processing passes and shaders. 